Alright, it's been a few days since the One UI 3.0 beta was completed for Samsung Galaxy Note 20 Ultra. The battery performance on this device has not been great for me, so I thought I will test it thoroughly and share the real life battery performance results with you guys. I did share the results during the beta in the past as well and at that point in time it was kind of performing really well and since the beta program was completed, I'm not getting any better results. So in this video, let me share the real life battery test results for Samsung Galaxy Note 20 Ultra on One UI 3.0. Before I share it, if you're new on the channel, let me just request you guys to hit that subscribe button to stay updated with Samsung Galaxy phones, Galaxy watches and Android applications. If you find this video useful, do smash that like button as well. Now, here are the results. I have tested the battery on two different scenarios. First one is on normal mode where the power saving mode was turned off, enhanced processing was turned off, adaptive battery was turned on, always on display was off and the phone was running on dark mode. And most importantly, the adaptive refresh rate was turned on. Here is the results for you guys. I have got 4 hour 22 minutes of screen on time, which is really, really poor. And I'm not really sure why was I getting such a bad screen on time on this particular mode. As you can see, I have used YouTube for about one hour. I have used camera for about 20 minutes, WhatsApp about 40 minutes. The phone calls were for about 40 minutes and a little bit of casual games here and there and many other basic applications. Now let's talk about the second scenario wherein I had turned on the power saving mode, selected the standard refresh rate, enhanced processing was turned off, adaptive battery was on, the phone was on dark mode and the always on display was turned off even in this case. In this scenario I have got screen on time of about 6 hours 50 minutes, close to about 7 hours I would say. Here again 1 hour 40 minutes of YouTube, camera for about close to 20 minutes, Call of Duty I played for about 20 minutes and rest of the applications as well as you can see here. Again 7 hours of screen on time on power saving mode is really not a great sign. Now to improve this I am left with only one option, I will either have to reset all the settings or I will have to do a factory data reset after which the results might improve. So these are the results on my Exynos Galaxy Note 20 Ultra. I request you guys to test your battery thoroughly and share your results in the comment section below. That will definitely help the Apex community. The battery test results for Note 10 Plus is also coming soon so stay tuned for that. That's all I have here. If you find this video useful do smash that like button and if you are new on the channel don't forget to subscribe. Thanks a lot for watching you guys take care and stay safe. Cheers bye bye.